Komodo 540. It's probably one of the easiest soccer training tools to use because it's effortless, it's cheap, it's lightweight, it's portable, right? For 24 bucks, I mean, you could just make this at home, size one or size two ball, length of rope, as long as your hip, hip bone to your ankle bone or maybe a little shorter. I like mine a little bit shorter, actually. Um, and then you could tie a knot off for a handle, but you know, it's just, it, it's just, you can get immediate feedback. Let's say you don't hit a good, the, let's say you miss hit it, you can immediately recorrect, right? And then have a nice strike, breathing. You could play some music, play your favorite song, whatever gets you in a great mood. You could be playing, you could be watching, uh, you know, Premier League, Champions League, whatever, and just be working, you know, on your balance. You get a BOSU ball out, any, any type of balance tools, um, anything, even a pillow. I have this slack block right here. Right? Insides, outsides, laces, shin. Mix it up, right? Around the back, over the top. Right? Um, you can work on your core rotation. Really nice striking. Switch hands. I really like this pattern. This two count, right? One, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. One, Two, crunching it, crunching in the core. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. And that's it, right? Breathing, relaxed. No tension in the body. Very relaxed. Breathing. Feel that core crunch. And that's it, right? Make one or buy one. Those are the two options get a lot of touches. You can get 60 touches in 60 seconds, which means walking around the block with your dog or something, or just going for a walk, you can get a thousand touches in close, ten, close thousand touches in between 10 to 15 minutes, effortlessly. And I'm not saying this is better than a wall, playing wall ball. I'm not saying it's better than a rebounder. I'm not saying it's better than a training partner. What I am saying is that Whenever you want to get better, whenever you want to get touches, you don't have to wait for anyone or anything. Just bring it with you wherever you go. A lot of touches, right? Effortless, easy. One minute a day, right? One minute a day. A lot of, a lot of players say, oh, I'm gonna train for two hours a day, three hours a day. They might get two days in a row. Day three comes around and they've set the bar too high and that stops them from actually playing, having more fun. You gotta s start a habit, small, low expectations. Everyone's got one minute, juggling, dribbling, ball striking. So hopefully this helps. Reach out with any questions. All right, thank you.